Hello YouTube, it's me, Ultimate Tech T. So, have you been? So, as you guys see, I'm playing a brand new game, and actually, this game, if you guys don't know what it's called, or sorry, I didn't really tell you what it's called, but you guys could probably read from the title. This is uh, Naruto Ultimate Ninja Blazing. So, this is a new uh, Android or iOS mobile game that just came out from Bandai, Bandai Namco, I believe, is the the like creator but uh yep so this is a new game that came out from them um and i'm actually not even playing in like the local servers i'm playing off an apk because this game hasn't come out in canada yet where i live canada uh so i just download an apk from google you guys could do the same naruto ultimate ninja, ninja blazing apk i'm running off the uk servers it's doing pretty fine for me what i'd recommend is for you guys to go to your uh ID or whatever that is, screenshot it so whenever this game does come out for your country you guys could just download it right away and then you guys are pretty set and have an account ahead of everyone else. So we have some stuff in our present box and a bunch of uh, junk that we got from uh, missions. I don't know if it's junk or not but I'm not really informed about this game. I haven't played the Japanese edition. When I heard the global is coming out I'm like why, why bother playing the Japanese version. Um, it's just more, more hassle and everything like that. So what we'll do is we'll go to uh, summons. I do plan on doing some summons for you guys, that's why I'm making a video. And then I think I'm going to do a gameplay with the new characters I will recruit. So uh, currently there's a multi summon, I think this happened in the Japanese edition as well, where there's a multi for 30 uh, gems or rubies or whatever it's called, um, the form of currency, um, instead of 50, the regular one. Uh, this game is obviously really similar to different games like Dragon Ball Z Dokken Battle, One Piece Treasure Cruise, Hunter x Hunter Battle also is per like all anime mobile games are pretty similar in like term ter terms of concept. Uh, so we'll jump right into the multi. I actually don't know the animations and how it works, but I think the more barriers it breaks the better and uh, hopefully we get a 5 star. Um, I'm not going to reroll, I don't believe in doing it this early in the game. Uh, and. I'm not really a big fan of rerolling to be honest. So uh, let's release. Hopefully we get something good. Please pray for me or do any like good luck charm you guys have. But that's one barrier, two barrier. I think if Sasuke joins him, that's something good. Then Sakura joins him. I don't know what. Oh god, I don't see any glow, so I don't think we got any five stars, which kind of sucks. But uh, whatever, we can't do anything about it. There's still two more multis we'll do in the near future. I'm gonna have to grind for some more gems or stones. But let's see who we got. Oh, Kisume, yes, super happy about that. Kisume, if you guys don't know, he's probably one of my favorite characters in Naruto. I just love this guy. Um, his art is very amazing. Like, uh, his backstory is pretty cool as well. I don't know, I just really enjoy uh, playing as him in uh, Ultimate Ninja Storm as well. So, um, and he's an overall great guy. Neji, a very rare Neji. I think this is 4 star, yeah, 4 star Neji. So, pretty much very similar to. Uh, Treasure Cruise where bronze is 3 star, silver is 4 star and uh, the other one is 5 star golden. Okay, so Anko, um, kind of weird character, pretty much like Orich Mars henchman. Oh, that's really cool, uh, third Hokage. I don't know if he's good at sea, I've used him as a friend captain, um, he's with uh, Sarutobi. Okay, if you guys um, don't know or like well, I haven't really told you guys ever, but I'm a pretty big fan of Naruto. I've lost a bit of interest after the manga finished and the anime decided to make a lot of filler. Currently, I'm not even watching the anime. I finished the manga two years ago when I did finish, uh, so I'm pretty bored um, and I kind of lost interest in Naruto, but she's really good, I think. But yeah, uh, let me know if you guys feel the same way. I think the filler is ruining the anime. Filler ruins every anime, like look at Bleach, it's over because of the filler, but Tayuya, uh, I think she's really good. When I saw some gameplay from the Japanese edition, um, they said she, she's really good, uh, I think she blinds or like stuns your opponent or something like that, but uh, let's see what you get. Oh, uh, Ino's dad, what's this guy's name? Uh, Inoichi Yamanaka. Okay, so uh, that's pretty much our multiple. I think it yeah, it shows you everything. So the Kiski is probably the highlight for me. Kiski, Neji, uh, Third Hokage, Sarutobi Sensei, and uh, Tayuya. Yeah, those are th the four guys we got that I am happy about. The other guys are all like trash in my opinion. But anyways, I'll show you guys my squad. I'll actually build a squad with you guys. And then we'll do a quick uh, gameplay to show you guys how the gameplay works and then end off the video there. Uh, so, yeah. Okay, uh, select all. Yeah, I think that's the one where you could change all of it. Uh, 
what should I do? Clear selection. Okay, so Naruto will be there. Uh, I'll put Tayuya, Kisune, Neji, and uh, third Hokage. Yeah, I think that's gonna be my really good roster. I don't know uh, if I should change it up anyway. If you guys are more like uh, familiar with this game, obviously give me tips and tricks and stuff like that. But so far, this <laughs> the team I was able to uh, form. And uh, we'll jump right into one uh, mission. I've done quite a few story missions already. Oh, where is this? What should I do? I think I'm gonna enhance them. Okay, I think I'm gonna enhance my Kisame. Uh, I told you, I love that guy. He's one of my favorite characters. And I'm gonna be able to release, uh, oh sorry, a free 10 spaces. So I'm just gonna feed him all of these. I know it might be a bit of a waste to feed all those, but uh, I don't mind because I told you. Early on in games, it doesn't matter what you really do, as long as you're playing the game uh, the way the tutorial told you, you're pretty good. But as you like progress in the game, that's when you have to pay more attention to what you do and how to like manage your money and uh, abilities and items and stuff like that. But anyways, success, I don't know what that means, I think that's a booster. Uh, no, that's not a, like 1.5 times booster or anything like that. But anyways, uh, that's the the enhancement, I guess. Uh, story. Let's jump right in. So the story follows the story of uh, Naruto. Um, so we finished graduation exam team seven, and now we're gonna do Land of Waves. I haven't even started the Land of Waves uh, arc, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I get to do it with Kisame. Um, what French should I take? I like that Itachi. Itachi is a pretty cool character. After like his whole reveal of how he he was, well, pretty much. I'm not gonna spoil anything, but he turned into a very badass character, and I really liked him after that point. Before that, I was very iffy about it because Sasuke wasn't one of my uh, like favorite characters, kind of. But mm, as the story progressed, Sasuke did get very annoying, uh, and Itachi like jumped up so much more. But anyways, uh, I'll show you guys the gameplay and end it off there. One uh, feature that I like and dislike is the auto play. So first I'll show you guys auto, you press auto, put two times uh, speed because why not and then you, like the game does everything for you, it's very fast, very efficient. Or if you guys don't want, you guys can turn it off and then do it all by yourself. So how you play is uh, you take Kisame or the guy I'm attacking with is Kisame currently, you go towards it. You try to attack the most characters you can, so this this is the best route for me. So what I'll do is I'll attack both these guys, I think it's, no it's not a finishing blow, but uh, oh shoot, they did a pretty hard hit on me. Uh, so what I'll do next is uh, I'll take, uh, oh shit. yeah it's Itachi, so I'll take Itachi, put him right in the middle so I'm able to attack everyone, attack and then him and Kisame, since uh, I put Kisame in the circle as well, you'll be able to do a group attack. And uh, that's how you kill your opponent. So now we'll, we'll go to the boss uh, battle. So most maps I think have three stages, but I guess as you progress it's different. But anyways, we're fighting with Naruto. So if you guys are wondering, or if you guys don't know, uh, tap on Naruto's icon right here, and that does his that awakens his uh, chakra, and then you're able to do an ability with him. Yep, I'm able to attack both of those guys. I think I, I could defeat them both at once, uh, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, that's not. It's not that bad, but it's not that strong either. Okay, so um, he attacked me for pretty heavy. Wait, I want to check something. So these are the stuff you have to do. Don't get hit by status. Okay, pretty pretty basic. Those are the stuff you have to do to get three uh, stars per mission. But anyways, where's the other guy? Okay, so Kisame. I'll do this. Yeah, I think that's effective because I'm able to get some health, I'm able to attack him pretty strong and uh, go right beside Naruto so I give him a boost and now we talk, oh shoot, this is dangerous that was dangerous, but anyways we talk, oh shh, can I put him back? I want to do his uh, special do that, and I think that's uh, the finishing blow so sorry if my tutorial or whatever, my guide was really bad. I told you, I don't play this game often. I just downloaded it today, so uh, I don't really know how the game works. But that's pretty much what I got out of it. I did a summon for you guys. That's actually the first summon I did, other than the tutorial summon that you have to do regularly. And that one I got Shik uh, Shikaku, which is... Uh, 
which is uh, Shikamaru's dad. And yep, so that was pretty much the video. Uh, let me know if you guys like this game. As always, um, if you guys want, I told you how to download it, get an APK. If you guys live in UK or Germany, I think. I don't know, there's a few countries where it is available, but it's not out in all countries. So if you guys don't get it out in your country, do use the APK. Uh, anyways, that was the gameplay. Oh, I missed that third one. But anyways, uh, I'm saying that a lot. Uh, as always, uh, see you next time at Ultimate Tech. As always, please like, subscribe, and share, and see you next time at Ultimate Tech Team.